Hi there, I'm Gary and this is Lindy and our little Ari and I just wanted to share a short testimony um, about 2020. Um, as you know, uh, I work overseas, um, I work on a commission basis and with COVID and the lockdowns, this has meant that you know, I haven't been able to travel and I haven't actually been able to earn income pretty much most of this year. Um, and a couple, well, for about a month and a bit ago, we've kind of hit our rock bottom in terms of our finances and you know, pretty much had nothing left. And over this time, it's really kind of made me trust God or start to trust in God a lot more. Um, normally, I'm the type of person that will you know, try and hustle my way out of things and try and always make a plan. And doesn't matter what plan I try to make uh, over this, this, yeah, pretty much this whole year, it just has not worked. So, yeah, like I said, we kind of hit our rock bottom about a month and a bit ago. Um, and yeah, it really kind of made me have to start trusting in God and his provisions because there was no way we could get out of it. And I just remember the one day just sitting out in the garden, I'm like, Lord, like, I really need you to come through for us. Like, I, there's nothing more that I can do to get us by for the rest of the year. Um, and I remember after that, I actually you know, went and I emailed our landlord and just said, look, we are you know, out of cash. We can't afford to stay here anymore. Um, we're pretty much done. Um, landlord replied about 15 minutes later, said, please just wait, I'm going to give you a call. And yeah, about 20 minutes later, they phoned us. Um, a landlord just said, look, you guys have been great tenants. We really would like you to stay in the house. Um, so if it helps you, we're not going to charge you rent for the next year. Um, and also just said, yeah, that if we were struggling to pay for the lights and water, they're happy to contribute towards that as well or pay for that, um, which was amazing. And then on top of that, uh, just like two days ago, um, they phoned us again just to say, look, they've their son is coming out uh, to the Middle East where they stay and they've got this car would we like to borrow their car as well which was also like another prayer that's been answered because I'm going to be working part-time from next week and we would have had to struggle with the cars yeah it's just been such a blessing and like family being able to bless us um, like financially as well with like vouchers and stuff and and obviously she's come along <laughs> but yeah it's been yeah it's been amazing what happens when you trust in God and I think it's just coming to a place where you, we had to fully surrender that we couldn't do any more. And it was completely just we left it in God's hands. And I think from that place, that moment of surrender, um, yeah, it's just crazy things have happened. And we've come to realize that God is our provider. Yeah, um, yeah that's it. Like, it's been amazing, yeah. really. So we just want to encourage you if you are trusting for something or believing for something like nothing is too much for God. I mean, rent for a whole year is just mind blowing. So yeah, we just yeah. want to encourage you.